The biggest thing we wanted to achieve was to make this feel as cinematic as possible. Almost like it was a user interface seen in Oblivion or Star Trek, but you can actually communicate with the application by using gestures and different motions. A lot of the users within this new generation of soldiers, they've grown up with this kind of digital aspect of life. So using gestures like pinch and zoom and tapping different locations on an iPad, it's something that brings this to them. It updates the applications from the paper maps that have been used. And though a lot of that has been taken into consideration, we really try to gear this towards an audience that understands these type of technical qualities that are from today. So we work to keep this kind of balance between futuristic user interfaces and realism. The client had requirements they needed to reach, which included you know, certain systems and interfaces that had to be kept in mind in regards to the design. The choice was made to go with an assetless approach using WebGL. And the only assets that were actually used within the project were items that were interchangeable by the client. Another great aspect about this is it's 100% real. There's no after effects. All of this is done through programming, and that's one of the benefits as far as creating something at IDM.